Welcome to Dance Poppy. I'm Serena. This is Nick. We're the co-directors of the Salsa Rueda Festival. And today we're going to show you a move called Sombrero. It looks like this. It starts with a dile que no into a redirection. Here's your sombrero. And it ends with a dile que no. All right. So you'll notice that this move has dile que no and a variation of basila. We have covered both of those uh, moves in previous videos. So be sure and check those out before you come back to this one. Okay, we're gonna break down the leader's footwork and lead first. So, we start in the dile que no position. One, two, three. I'm gonna switch hands on seven, redirecting her movement on the eight. I'm gonna catch the other hand as she passes in front of me. You'll notice, leaders, that I have no weight on my left foot. So I'm gonna step forward behind her on my one, just like in Vasila. We go one, two, three. She continues walking to my side, five, six, seven and I'm going to bring one hand behind her head and one hand behind my head. Now it's super important here leaders that you when you let go of the hands on the dile que no you're going to bring your right hand to her left shoulder giving her enough room to extract that arm on the second dile que no. All right let's look at the followers footwork. So we're going to start in a dile que no one two three five six seven eight. Notice on the eight, no weight is on my right foot. I'm fully weighted on my left foot and my left arm is available so that when I turn, the leaders can grab that hand. On the one, I'm gonna step forward. This is the same footwork as Vastila. I'm gonna turn two, three. I'm gonna continue turning on five, six, seven. I'm walking to my leader's side. Here, my arm is trapped, but the leaders are gonna give me some space so that I can extract my arm on one, two, three, completing the move on five, six, seven. So here are a few tips to improve your sombrero. First, for the followers, make sure that you're like a basila, you're traveling in an arc closely connected to your leader. That means that on three, one, two, three, I'm very close to my leader and moving in an arc rather than traveling down a line in this move. I complete the move towards his side, six, seven, and we finish off with the dile que no. Okay, leaders. So check it out, here's an important tip for you when leading sombrero, okay? You wanna make sure that, um, first of all, that you're fingertip to fingertip. You don't wanna be clutching or gripping her hands in any way. This cuts down on the amount of room that you have between yourself and your partner. So fingertip to fingertip is ideal. Also, uh, make sure that her elbows stay below her shoulders whenever possible. So although I may bring the hands over her head to start or during the turn, I make sure that in the middle, her elbows are below her shoulders. They come up and then down again in a nice relaxed manner into the ending with a dile que no. Okay, now we're gonna show you this move a couple of times in both directions. Here we go. And one, two, three, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, five, six, seven, again, two, three, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, Six, seven, and one. Okay, we'll show you from the other direction. Five, six, seven, and one, two, three. Five, six, seven, and one, two, three. Six, seven, and one more time. Five, six, seven, and one, two, three. Six, seven, and one. Five, six, seven, and one. I like turtles. Thank you for watching Sombrero here on Dance Poppy. Be sure and like it. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel so you get all the latest videos. I am Nick, and this is Serena, and we'll see you next time. Hi, welcome to Dance Poppy. I'm Serena, this is Nick, we're the coder. <laughs> What is wrong now? See, did you just go on with the first take? We just <laughs> left it at that. I like turtles.